Here I want to show you how to link data between worksheets within a workbook. So basically how we can have data on one sheet here and pull it into another sheet. And this will allow you to have a sheet that could contain your raw data that you will never touch or at least you're not going to edit the figures on that sheet. And then use your other worksheets to manipulate, augment, and display that data however you want. So let's go ahead and get started with this sample data here. We've got month, sales, bunch of numbers, and what I want to do is to just quickly pull in all of this data into sheet two. So we go to sheet two. Let's start in cell A1. And all we're really going to be doing is to enter a formula. So we start with the equal sign. Now we need to navigate to the cell that contains the data we want to bring into here. So we go to sheet one, select cell A1, and before navigating away from sheet one, hit the enter key. Now we've got the data from sheet one, cell A1. So we can continue this equals, go to where the data is located, click the cell we want, hit enter, and so on. Now, before I show you a really quick way to do this, let me show you what happens if you hit the equal sign, go to sheet one, click the cell you want. Now, if you navigate away from here before you hit the enter key, look up here, right now it says equals sheet one, exclamation point A3. If we go to sheet two, it'll say equals sheet two, exclamation point A3. Sheet three, same thing. So that's why you want to hit the enter key before you leave the worksheet that contains the data you want to pull into the other worksheet. Now a really quick way to bring it in is to select the cell that contains the formula we just entered on sheet 2, go to the quick fill handle in the bottom right hand corner, and pull it all the way down. Now let's go ahead and select all this data, quick fill handle, pull it to the right, 1. Now notice that none of the formatting is coming through. And actually, if that was a little bit confusing for you, note that it's just from relative cell references. So since we don't have dollar signs in front of the A1 here, we can use the quick fill handle to quickly pull in lots of data. Now that we've done that, let's go ahead and add some formatting. So it doesn't bring in any formatting and that allows you to add whatever type of formatting you want. And it's not going to change what was on the other sheet. And now that we've got this data here, we can do anything that we want to it, such as equals this, divided by 10, and it acts as if the number were actually in this cell. And that's really all there is to linking data between worksheets within a single workbook.